Hey, what's up, gang? Hope you're all doing well. Hope you're getting ready for a nice weekend. I have something to break for you. Masahiro Tanaka is opting back into his contract in Japan. So unfortunately, he will not be coming back to the majors. He won't be coming back to New York. I know there are a lot of folks who wanted him back here as another addition to the rotation, which they still need to address, the Yankees. Um, but that said, he'll be heading back there. And again, it's, there's no, I'm not surprised because there's no real clear resolution right now with what's going on. I did a video... Uh, it's in the description going over some of the parameters of the collective bargaining agreement. And one of the things, the observations that was made um, by Harold Reynolds and Matt Forsagen on the MLB Network is, and I remember this, was that the players union themselves <clears throat> felt recently that the last two CBAs or the collective bargaining agreements, they kind of were on the losing side of it. So what they're trying to do now is essentially make up for losing them. And um, that's one reason why their demands are so aggressive now. So I think it's going to be a little bit more contentious than we expect, unfortunately. And hopefully, you know, it won't get to the point where we're at 94, 95. That was a 230-plus day lockout. So, <clears throat> and it went from the end of 94, when you canceled the playoffs, into the 95 season and through May, where there were replacement players. So that was a pretty significant lockout. And um, unfortunately, hopefully we don't get there now. Hopefully these cooler heads will prevail, but... There's a lot of things to resolve here. You know, both sides are definitely not on the same page. Uh, at least they are with maybe a couple things, but the main things in terms of service time and arbitration and whatever else, there's a lot. There's a lot of work to be done. So, um, but with that, <clears throat> Tanaka's going back to Japan. I wouldn't be surprised if a couple other major league players go to Japan. I, I reported already. Freddie Galvis is headed to Japan. Chris Kittens from the Yankees, or formerly from the Yankees, is headed to Japan too. Um, and any other news that breaks, I'll be feeding it to you. So if you're not subscribed to the channel, do that now and hit the bell icon so that you know everything that's going on. So, and then I'll obviously I'll keep you updated with regards to the collective bargain agreement and this lockout too. So have a great weekend, everybody. Talk to you next time.